published 0642 EDT, the 22nd of August 2017 updated 0803 EDT, the 22nd of August 2017 Elise Knowles and her tradesman boyfriend, Josh Barker, have never really seen eye to eye with rivals Ronnie and Georgia, and on the block on Tuesday, the couples had a heated showdown during a body corporate meeting with all the teams, Josh slammed the pair, calling them pork chops, as they were the only team to not allow him and Elise to get cracking on their backyard, ahead of landscape week, scroll down for video you guys are carrying on like a pork chop Elise Knowles boyfriend Josh pictured slams rivals Ronnie and Georgia during a heated showdown Ronnie and Georgia opposed Josh and Elise's plan, as they thought it was unfair for them to start on an area ahead of time, with the rules being that one space gets done in a week, Josh and Elise wanted to start laying footings for their pool so their landscaper had time to complete his design and needed all teams to approve so they could go ahead, despite the inside home renovations not being completed, you made your bed guys, you lie in it. You guys are carrying on like a pork chop from week one day. Josh said at one point, Clash Josh slammed Ronnie and Georgia pictured as they were the only team to not allow him and Elise to get cracking on their backyard, ahead of landscape week trouble on site. The rivals had the heated showdown during a body corporate meeting with all the teams pictured Ronnie and Georgia objected, because they claimed it wasnt fair, I knew we only had one week to do the landscaping. If I would've known I could've changed it and had three or four weeks and come up with something absolutely amazing, Ronnie said, with him and Georgia putting in a prefabricated pool in their yard. During the clash, Ronnie and Georgia said that they designed their landscaping before they landed in Melbourne to start the show, with Georgia saying she saw ideas on Instagram, Sticks fired up, saying they were trying to get ahead, themselves, speaking up, Sticks pictured fired up, saying Ronnie and Georgia were trying to get ahead themselves, you already knew the plans before you got here, that's not fair to everyone else, how's that different, using plans and planning your own house before you get here and you're putting the brakes on them. Georgia said it wasnt cheating, as they were planning. They really got the other teams offside when they reminded everyone that the block is a competition, and that they're not here to make friends. At the end of the day, there's this friendship and vibe thing and that's cool, but for us, it's a competition, Georgia said, everyone is aware there is $100,000 at stake here. Ouch the pair said they're not that interested in making friends on the show for us, it's a little bit of strategy. And we're totally aware that if we bring something to the table, everyone will probably say no to that. That's what it's about. They said they didnt like that Josh and Elise had booked in a landscaper at the beginning of the show and questioned if they were cheating. Jason meanwhile, said Ronnie and Georgia's stance was nasty and rude. Ronnie also said that he doesn't want to give Josh and Elise his approval, as he is concerned they will steal their buyer come auction day and want to win. At the end of the clash, Elise and Josh were told they can't start work on their backyard but took comfort in the fact that Ronnie and Georgia are renovating the middle block, getting everyone offside. Jason R. Meanwhile, said Ronnie and Georgia's stance was nasty and rude. It means they won't get access through the other team's backyard if they want to put a pool in or any other objects. They're stuck in the middle and screwed, Wombat said. Afterwards, at dinner with Wombat and Sticks, Josh slammed Ronnie and Georgia, saying they're not effing talented at what they do. At the end of the day, auctions don't leave. He's shown his true colors, ouch afterwards, at dinner with Wombat and Sticks, Josh slammed Ronnie and Georgia, saying they're not effing talented at what they do.